Last night, Senator Carper and I released an investigative report detailing the threat of China's talent recruitment programs and what it poses to U.S.-funded research. I think most people have no idea that their tax dollars are going to Washington, D.C. to fund research, which is a good thing. You know, this is research into cures for diseases. It's research into, you know, the best and latest developments in our military. But that research is being taken from the United States to China through these programs like the Thousand Talents program. The American taxpayer has, in effect, unwittingly funded research that has contributed to China's global rise over the past 20 years. The Chinese government identifies researchers in the United States they think are doing promising research, gives them a contract, actually pays them, says in the contract you can't reveal this contract, uh, which is of course unethical but also illegal in terms of the U.S. research institutes. China then uses the research it wouldn't otherwise have to advance its own economic and military interests. China's stated goal is to be the world's leader in science and technology by 2050. We always seek new ways to improve our effectiveness. With our present day knowledge of the threat from Chinese talent plans, we wish we had taken more rapid and comprehensive action in the past, and the time to make up for that is now. We appreciate the conclusions of your report. It's a real problem, so we're working on legislation already to try to fix it. And our taxpayers don't want to be the ones to pick up the tab as China misappropriates our research to build up its own economy and a military designed to rival ours.